Hello guys, how you doing? Today I'm here to tell you about the Express Entry Draw 165th which was conducted today just a few hours before. This is the largest draw ever conducted by IRCC. So Canada has conducted this largest draw ever in the history of Express Entry System. We'll talk about this draw in detail, what was the cutoff score, how many people were invited. But before that, let me tell you that now I'm there on Instagram as well. So if you're there on Insta, you can follow me at Dreamers Abroad. It's all about fun, all about my life in Canada. If you have any queries about the immigration, we've got a Dream Abroad Canada Facebook group, which has got more than 76,000 people helping each other achieve their dreams. So if you're on Facebook and if you have any queries, you can join this Facebook group. Okay, now coming back to the Express Entry Draw 165th. This draw is the largest draw because 4,500 invitations were issued in this draw. In the last few draws, we have seen that the maximum number of invitations that were issued were 4,200, but 300 more people were, have been invited in this draw, which makes it the largest draw ever conducted by Express Entry. So that was the first point which was amazing about this draw. The second point which was amazing is the cutoff score. So you've seen that cutoff score is 471 which was same as the cutoff score in the last express entry draw. Even after such a big draw has been conducted, but the cutoff score hasn't gone down even a single point, which dictates the popularity of this program, which dictates that how many people are actually interested. In just 15 days time, so many people must have gone into the express entry pool with such good scores that the cutoff score hasn't gone down. But this certainly does not mean that the cutoff score would not go down in the... But this certainly does not mean that the cutoff score would not go down in the upcoming draws. So in the next few draws, we can expect the cutoff score to go down slowly just by one point or two points. And that's what I said in the prediction video that the cutoff score won't go down too much, but you can expect it to go down slowly. So if Canada continues to conduct such big draws in the future as well that 4,500 people get invited, then you can definitely see the drop in the cutoff score in the upcoming draws as well. Okay, moving over to the tie-breaking rule. The tie-breaking rule was September 1st, 2020 at this time. So all in all, just in the last four draws, Canada has now invited more than 17,000 people, which is really, really great. And it shows that Canada still needs immigrants badly. Now, before we discuss the CRS score distribution of candidates, let me tell you that now Canada has invited close to 83,000 people just in 2020 which is such a good number and they surely would be achieving their target of 91,800 in the upcoming draws. Okay, talking about the CRS score distribution of candidates in the express entry pool. This is actually interesting because now we can actually compare the number of candidates 14 days ago and what's the condition now. So we can see that you know, all these people must have got the ITA, which means that just in the last 14 days, more than 450 people with approved PNP applications went into the pool and obviously they would have got the ITA today. The most interesting score range is this one 471 to 480. In the last draw there were 2857 people. Most of them would have got the ITA. Just a few of them who could not cross the tie breaking rule at 471 wouldn't have got the ITA but again we see that there are 2,409 people in this score range, which is really astonishing and which dictates the popularity of this program. The, the other CRS score range, 461 to 470, is also very interesting because you can regularly see that in every draw, we can see the number of people rising in this CRS score range. So the last time there were less than 10,000 people, this score range, 9,854, and now there are more than 10,500 people in this score range. So all those people waiting in the late 460s, like 468, 469s, I know you would be disappointed by this draw. Even when 4,500 people were invited, there is not a single point drop in the cutoff score. But I would say that you should remain hopeful and optimistic because in the upcoming draws, you can definitely see a drop in the cutoff score. If Canada keeps conducting the all program draws and that too in such big numbers. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you like the video, please click the like button. If you have any feedback, please put it down in the comment section below. And yes, if you haven't subscribed this channel, please click the subscribe button. 
because you get regular updates about immigrating and settling in Canada every passing week. Thanks again for watching this video.